Hi, it's Lisa from A Simple Season. Today I'm gonna to show you how I make my delicious pickled eggs. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to cook our eggs. So I'm going to bring this pot of water with the eggs in it up to a boil, and then I'm going to turn off the heat and cover the pan and leave it for 10 minutes. After that, I'm going to drain the water, cover them in cold water, and leave them for another 10 minutes, and then peel them. Now we're gonna work on making our brine, and the recipe is super easy to remember. Half a cup of water, half a cup of vinegar, half a cup of sugar, half a teaspoon of pickling spice, and that's all you need to make the brine. So a half, a half, a half, and a half. So I'll show you how that works. I have water heating up right now, and then we're gonna add our sugar and our vinegar until the sugar dissolves. Then we're gonna put in our pickling spice. Our water is just about boiled here, so that's hot enough that I'm gonna add the sugar in. And I'm going to give this a stir just so that it starts to dissolve. And I'm going to pour in the vinegar and heat it all through. Now I'm gonna put in my half a teaspoon of pickling spice. And that smells amazing. You can add a little bit more or a little bit less depending on what you like. I tend to add a little bit more than a half a teaspoon just because I like the flavor that it imparts to the pickled eggs. And if you wanna know what kind of pickling spice I use, this is just a generic pickling spice that I picked up at my local grocery store in the bulk section. It's not any particular brand, it's just called pickling spice. And it's just a mix of cloves and cinnamon, there's cardamom, bay leaves, all kinds of goodies in there. And this is what's gonna give your pickled eggs an amazing flavor. Our brine is ready now and it's nice and hot. All the sugar is dissolved, which is exactly what we want. And here I have 11 eggs. So remember I said to soak them in cold water for 10 minutes after they finished boiling. The reason we do that is so they're easier to peel. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put a few eggs in. And I also have a half a chopped onion right here. I'm gonna throw in a few pieces of onion so that I've got a little bit of onion, some eggs, some more onion. These onions, once they've been pickled, oh, they're so good. I'll layer these up, see how many I can fit in there. Yeah, it looks like I'm gonna get 10 eggs in for a quart jar. And let's see how I've measured out this brine. So we're gonna take our hot brine Put it over the top and that should fill it. That looks pretty good. All we do now is we just take the lid for our jar, put that on and I just flip it over and this can stay in the fridge for three to four months and you can enjoy pickled eggs whenever you want. They'll be ready to eat after two to three days sitting in the fridge, just so it gives it enough time for all of those flavors to really just mix together and give it a nice flavor. And that's how they look when they're all done. And like I said, they'll keep for a few months in the refrigerator and they're so delicious. Once again, thanks so much for joining me and we'll see you next time.